wish you were on the other side of those trees, Jason. I do. I wish I was someplace else. Get right down to it. Power saw just put a little scratch on the back side there, though, Bill. Yeah, pick them up on the 400. Recently, on the Wiley Creek drainage out of Sweet Home. Yeah, it's a really nice wood. It was tall, nice size, but really good height. And, uh, it was at about 3,500, if I remember right. And the storm blew in that day, it started raining early on and the wind picked up throughout the day. By the time I was cutting this little piece here, it was really howling. So with tall wood and high wind, it's a pretty tricky combination. It's we know, you know if, you, if you've cut in it, you know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I used a couple of little tricks to try to ensure that I, I saved it out. Maintained what control I could over the trees. And cutting into the wind so your head is on the lee side of the wind is really good. the power of the tower behind you and hit yourself some control. Like this tree here, I put a little face in it. I quartered it hard, so when I come behind it and cut it, I've got holding wood that can help me control it. Yeah, but when you get right down to it, high wind is not really a whole lot of fun. Sometimes you just have to keep going and get it done. She goes. Yeah, I think the thing, that's the thing. A little extra care when things are bad it makes everything go well. Get it done. Get it done safely. It's the name of the game. Thanks again for watching. Be safe.